Breaking news. Shepard Smith reporting live from the Fox News deck. We're just getting new reports on the powerful earthquake that has hit Mexico City in the last 20 minutes. And we've gotten in new video as well. This is coming into us from television stations in Mexico. The earthquake, a 7.1, according to the United States Geological Survey, it struck, as I said, sometime in the last 20 minutes or so. And this is the first video that came into us from one of the local television stations. You can see what appears to be dust around buildings, possibly smoke. At this point, we're not sure, but there are reports of no fires. To the next video, and <clears throat> we'll show you more that's just come into us. This is from inside Telemundo's news studios in Mexico City. Listen. The earthquake set off alarms across Mexico City, a city of more than 8 million people, and thousands of people fled into the streets. This is from inside someone's home. Listen. And this video <clears throat> said to be of a building facade collapsing, though authorities have not yet confirmed that this video was from day today. Our sources indicate that it's from a good uh, from a good source and that we believe that's accurate. This also from a local television station. The, the earthquake itself was about 31 miles below ground, which is fairly shallow. Uh, for this region. It's the second earthquake to hit this region in this month. They've been doing earthquake drills over the over the last few few weeks. And excuse me, this is from Azteca Television video that has just come in. But as we're watching this, breaking news now and President Trump speaking live. Let's listen. The president saying the United States is making great progress. And further that, on the matter of uh, potentially, if they don't do right, destroying North Korea, as was mentioned earlier, the president saying, we'll see what happens. Much more from the United Nations to come. First to our breaking news in Mexico City. These pictures now from TV Azteca. And my understanding is, yes, this is live video coming in. Remember, uh, this area is in what amounts to central time in the United States. You can see here that a ceiling has collapsed inside a building. Uh, this is live coverage that they have, though we have reason to believe that this may be tape from a short time ago, and sure enough, it is. They're now playing videos that have been confirmed from inside Mexico City. In the early going now, we don't have reports of widespread injuries. I'll read you the latest from Associated Press. Mexico City's main boulevard today, thousands of people have streamed out of buildings and into the streets in what Associated Press calls in a panic filling the plaza around Independence Monument with a mass of people. Traffic has come to a standstill. Masses of workers have blocked the streets. Clouds of dust are rising from falling pieces of facade. So those images that we were showing you a short time ago uh, of the facades collapsing and the wide angle videos from across the city, that's the dust that was rising up from around Mexico City. Two men claimed a uh, calmed a woman who, with blood trickling from a small wound on her knee, seated on a stool on that same street, telling her to breathe deeply in Spanish. And again, it's this sort of facade collapse that's causing the dust that you saw in all those videos. We're told it's not fires. Continuing the Associated Press, at a nearby market off that main boulevard, a worker in a hard hat walked along around outside of the building warning people not to smoke as they were smelling cooking gas in the air. Market stall vendor, one of them told Associated Press that she'd been in a taxi a few blocks away when the quake struck. She said she saw glass bursting out of some of the, some of the buildings. A number of buildings, reporting of the Associated Press, have seriously damaged, been seriously damaged. Again, a 7.1. As you see, local television stations are broadcasting images of this. The United States.